If you're a millionaire, you may have some nice cars and maybe even a few nice houses. But if you're royalty and have billions of dollars to your name, you don't just have a nice house, you have a castle with 35 bedrooms and an entire staff of servants fulfilling your every need. Today, we're going to be looking at the most luxurious castles and palaces fit for royalty. Before we get started, make sure that you subscribe and click the bell. That way you're notified when we post a new video. Number 10. Amberley Castle, England The castle is located less than 60 miles southwest of London in the picturesque West Sussex countryside in the village of Amberley. The castle now serves as a unique luxury hotel with over 900 years of history. The castle has ancient medieval architecture and serves as a beautiful retreat for its guests. The castle is still completely enclosed by a 60-foot high curtain wall, which is flanked by a magnificent twin tower gatehouse to the south. The castle has 19 bedrooms, each with a unique design and furnished with antiques and luxurious fabrics. Amberley Castle serves their guests gourmet meals, which can either be enjoyed in the Queen's Room or in the Great Room. The magnificent Queen's Room has barrel vaulted ceilings dating back to the 12th century and has an open fireplace. The castle sits on 12 acres and many guests like to walk around and enjoy the beautiful formal gardens that are inside the castle walls. The rose-covered archways and topiary are truly magical. Number 9. Dromoland Castle, Ireland One of the most magical places in Ireland and one of the most famous baronial castles is the Dromoland Castle. It's been housing guests within its walls since the 16th century. The castle was built of beautiful dark blue limestone and fine chiseled workmanship. The castle is now a luxury hotel and provides modern comfort, magnificent bedrooms, fabulous views, and indulgent dining to its guests. The castle is located on 450 acres and it also has a world-class 18-hole championship golf course. But if you don't feel like playing golf, you can always relax at the castle's luxurious spa. The castle has many beautiful bedrooms throughout to ensure that each guest has a wonderful stay. After a $23 million renovation, this historic castle hotel has been upgraded for the modern traveler. However, the castle hasn't lost its historic charm. There are activities like falconry walks through the forest, pony rides, clay shooting, fishing, horseback riding, and biking. Former President George W. Bush spent the night at Dromoland Castle back in 2004 and was guarded by approximately 7,000 police, military, and private security forces during his 16-hour visit. Other famous guests include Bill Clinton, Nelson Mandela, Muhammad Ali, Richard Branson, Jack Nicholson, Johnny Cash, and John Travolta. Number 8. Chateau de Bagnole, France this fortress has been magnified by eight centuries of French lifestyle and overlooks the Beaujolais vineyards. The chateau has luxurious suites, each richly decorated with frescoes, tapestries, and restored antiques. In addition to that, each of the 21 suites has a fireplace and opens out to the garden so you can smell the countryside. The chateau includes a heated pool, spa services, tennis courts, and a prestigious restaurant. The chateau's moats, towers, and walls are surrounded by vines amid the French-style gardens. Guests can enjoy a candlelit dinner in front of a monumental Gothic fireplace and can enjoy traditional local cuisine. Guests also have the opportunity to arrange activities like skiing, horse riding, or hot air ballooning. Number 7. Chateau Le Crayer, France Le Crayer was built in 1901 in a park which covers 7 hectares. The chateau is a magical property in the heart of Rennes. It's nestled next to lush vegetation and has an atmosphere of elegant sophistication. Guests are greeted with beautiful rooms and suites that are filled with classical French style detail. Each room has antiques and beautiful couture fabrics. There's also impeccable dining at the gourmet restaurant. The restaurant even features a wine list with more than 600 champagne labels. You'll have to wear a suit and tie to this restaurant for sure. Number 6. Inverlochy Castle Hotel, Scotland This beautiful Scottish castle was built in the 19th century near Fort William in the highlands of Scotland. The castle is surrounded by a rich history and a breathtaking landscape. In 1873, even Queen Victoria spent a week at Inverlochy. 
She spent her time sketching and painting while staying at the castle. She even wrote in her diaries, I never saw a lovelier or more romantic spot. You know that if a queen says it's the best place she's ever stayed at, then it must be something special. Each of the 17 bedrooms and suites has its own individual character and style in addition to amazing views. The castle also has its own private lake. Guests can also have an elegant, fine dining experience in any of the three dining rooms, each decorated with furniture from the period and gifts to the Inverlochy Castle from the King of Norway. Guests can also enjoy nearby activities like fishing, golfing, whitewater rafting, and mountain biking. Number 5. Hearst Castle Estate, California Back in 1919, William Randolph Hearst built an extraordinary estate on his 250,000-acre ranch overlooking the town of San Simeon. By 1947, the hilltop complex included a twin-towered main building, three guest houses, and 127 acres of terraced gardens, fountains, and pools. There's also a one-of-a-kind gothic study in Hearst's private suite. This is where Hearst previewed his newspapers every night before printing. There are beautiful concrete arches, and the historic ceiling dates back to as early as the 1400s. The room even has 150 ancient Greek vases. The estate also has a world-famous outdoor pool. It was restored and repaired and then refilled in August of 2018. The pool is huge and is surrounded by tall columns, giving it a grand feel. There's also a tiled indoor pool decorated with eight statues of Roman gods, goddesses, and heroes. The castle has many opulent social rooms, including a morning room, assembly room, refectory, billiard room, and theater. There's also a wine cellar filled with the finest wine money could buy. The estate is filled with breathtaking works of art from around the world. There are a total of 46 rooms in the guest houses, including lobbies. Number 4. Schönbrunn Palace, Austria Located in Vienna, the Schönbrunn Palace was the main summer residence of the Habsburg rulers. The 1,441-room Rococo Palace is one of the most important architectural, cultural, and historic monuments in the country. The history of the palace spans over 300 years, and it has been a major tourist attraction since the 1950s. One of the palace's notable rooms is the Great Gallery. It's 40 meters long and 10 meters wide and was used for balls and receptions years and years ago. The room has beautiful painted ceilings and gold accents. Other rooms in the palace include the East Asian Cabinets, the Carousel Room, the Hall of Ceremonies, and the Gobelin Salon. The palace also has beautiful gardens for visitors to tour. Number 3. Neuschwanstein Castle, Germany This is easily one of the most beautiful castles in the world. It's even the castle that inspired many Disney movie castles. And it's easy to see why. With the lush forest, nearby lake, and surrounding mountains, living in this castle would be like living in a fairy tale, to say the least. Had it been completed, the castle would have had more than 200 interior rooms, including rooms for guests and servants. Ultimately, no more than about 15 rooms and halls were finished. The Hall of Singers is beautifully decorated and has massive chandeliers along with immaculate details on every inch of the walls. The largest room in the castle by area is actually the Hall of Singers, followed by the Throne Hall. The Throne Hall has bright blue pillars with yellow and gold colored walls and beautifully painted murals. There's also a drawing room with tall wooden ceilings, colorful murals, and another large chandelier. There's also a study room that looks like a work of art. The details in the main bedroom are breathtaking. The intricate designs in the wood on the bed frame alone are enough to make you feel like royalty. There's even a cool grotto. I mean, this castle really does have it all. What do you think of this fairy tale castle? Comment down below and let us know. Number 2. Ashford Castle, Ireland This 1,800-year-old castle is truly stunning and has spectacular surroundings, beautiful interiors, and delicious cuisine for guests. The castle is located on a 350-acre estate with landscaped gardens and is surrounded by beautiful trees and a sparkling lake. The castle and its accommodations were voted best of the best by Virtuoso and have been recognized with countless other awards. 
There are 83 rooms and suites at the castle that have been individually designed and include modern features while still keeping the castle's original style. There's also a Reagan presidential suite named after President Reagan who stayed at the Ashford in 1984. There's even a boathouse, now called the Hideaway Cottage, where guests can stay and enjoy the lake views as well as the private gardens. There are six restaurants and three bars with world-renowned chefs to give each guest a dining experience fit for a king. There's also beautiful gardens, and the castle even offers exceptional private wine tasting in their stunning stone wine cellars. But if guests aren't up to wine tasting, they can always sit back and relax in the Oak Hall and play a game of chess. Or perhaps they would rather enjoy traditional afternoon tea in the Connaught Room. There's also an award-winning spa with a pool, five treatment rooms, sauna, and steam room. Number 1. Palace of Versailles, France The history of the Palace of Versailles starts in the 17th century. It's transformed throughout the years from a hunting lodge to a palace for royals, and finally in the 19th century, it turned into a museum. The estate includes the palace, the gardens, the park, and Trianon Estate, and several buildings in town. Today, the estate spreads over more than 1,900 acres. One of the most famous rooms in the palace is the Hall of Mirrors. The whole length of the Hall of Mirrors pays tribute to the political, economic, and artistic success of France. Political successes are illustrated through the 30 paintings on the vaulted ceiling. There are 357 mirrors that line the 17 arches opposite the windows. Every inch of the room is covered in remarkable detail. There's also the War Room, which pays tribute to the military victories which led to the peace treaties of Nijmegen. The walls of this room are covered with marble panels and decorated with six trophies and weapons in gilded bronze. There's also the Peace Room, which is symmetrical to the War Room and is decorated very similarly to the War Room, but instead the decoration revolves around the benefits of peace brought to Europe by France. The King's State Apartment is made up of seven rooms. One of the rooms in the King's Apartment is the Hercules Room, and it's composed of beautiful marble and painted ceilings. There's also the Venus Room, the Diana Room, and the Mars Room. The Mars Room has beautiful red walls with large paintings and a painted ceiling. There's also the Mercury Room, which was the King's royal bedchamber. Another historic room in the palace is the Gallery of Great Battles. It covers almost the entire first floor of the South Wing, and it depicts nearly 15 centuries of French military successes through about 30 paintings. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and click the bell. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.